Hi everyone, Art with Artemis here, and today I'm going to show you how to make your very own poster of Among Us. If you have a hard time understanding of how to draw the character, feel free to check out my previous video of how to draw an Among Us character, just so you can get the basic idea, which is where I go over it a little bit more. What you're going to need is some paints, a cup of water, a paper towel, pencils with erasers. You're also going to need some paint brushes too. For this poster, I'm going to start by making a moon which I'm going to go towards the bottom and make it kind of arced. Like how on the title screen they're all standing on the arced planet and they're in the cool looking pose. So I'm going to try and copy that. Then I'm going to go towards the middle of my page and start sketching a top line curve. And I'm going to go down to get the side part of the body. And I'm going to work on the other side. Now I'm going to start working on the foot. But the okay, Eraser, you know what? Just, just, just go. Okay, so where was I? We're gonna start from the bottom of the foot, and I wanna round it off and make it go towards the under part of the belly. So I sketch that upward, and I continue to work on the other leg. Like I said in my previous video of making Among Us characters, they're kind of shaped like beans, and also like an A. I go to the right side of the body, and I sketch downward, connecting it to its other foot. When I finish doing that, I move over to the left side of the picture and fix the backpack, which is kind of curved or almost a little bit arced. When I'm done with that, I sketch in the goggle part of the eye. I draw this by making an oval, and I go over the line on the right. It's okay it goes over the line for this particular project, because I'm going to be using paint so it doesn't entirely matter too much, just as long as I didn't make it too dark. And yeah, I think it'll turn out pretty good. For the next part, you don't really have to do this if you don't want to, but it might give you a better idea for when we actually paint this in. With the Among Us characters, they have an outline to them, making it look kind of thick. So, I'm going to make it look like the line art, and also, I will be adding some details to the surface the character is on. To do that, we draw on the inside, and we add it and make it look like a line inside. We trace around the lines that we've already made from the inside. After I do that, I start adding in the craters of the moon, or whatever planet it is. Which I use an oval, and then in the inside of the oval, I use a curved line and add extra lines to it. It's kind of different, so that way it shows depth and perception. When I finish that, I decide to draw another character floating in space, so I go ahead and do that. And also, I make this character wave. So it's kind of silly, he's just randomly floating in space, which is kind of cool. Then I grab my paintbrush, and I get some black, and I start painting in the background. I make sure I go around the figures of the Among Us characters. Once you've finished painting your background and letting it dry, we're going to get our paintbrush and get some white. We're going to wet it a little bit, and then I'm going to grab my paintbrush and hold it like so, and start flicking it. Doing this can cause some paint to splatter, giving it a star look and that sort of effect. And I do this all the way around my painting. It's okay if you get it where the characters are at, because in the end we're going to color them up. I'm also going to use some blue and some yellow. Once I finish doing the sky, I color the characters with their basic colors. Make sure you go over it a couple times and let it dry. Once I finish doing that, I work on the goggle part of the character. I then get some gray, and I start working on the moon part that I was working on earlier. I try to go around a bit of the character's feet. It's okay if I don't have it exactly perfect right now. And I do this all over. Then I go back and finish up some details such as the glass part of his goggle. And I make sure I color it in thoroughly. I grab my gray and I repaint the gray part around the goggle. So that way it stands out a little bit more. I also make sure I do the same details that I did for the red one on the yellow character. Then I grab my big black sharpie and I trace around the character, so that way it stands out a little bit more. I'm not going to be using paint or whatever for my outline because I don't want to screw that up. So I do that with the big sharpie, all the way around. I make a different color gray and I go underneath the red character and I make some shadowing. Then I get my sharpie and I make some of the craters. 
please note before you do this, make sure that your main color background is dry. So that way it doesn't accidentally smudge or it feels really weird sometimes if you accidentally do it and the paint is still wet. And it'll mess up the sharpie a little bit. Then I go ahead and I grab some grays and I try and fix the inner part to show that there's some darker lighting. Then I try and use a light gray and I smear it with my finger. I accidentally made this one on the far left a little bit too much. As for the others, they look pretty good. I didn't do it as severe. So I'm going to try and cover it up and I'm going to fix it with a gray. And I'm going to cover over this right here. And I screwed that up right there. I could have sworn my gray was the same color on my palette. So you know what I'm going to do? Here's what I'm going to do, guys. I'm going to show you. You can actually fix this. Well, for starters, I'm going to let it kind of dry a bit. And then I'm going to grab my gray and I'm going to paint it. It looks like, almost like a tombstone. But it's not going to be a tombstone. What this is here is going to be the body of another character. Since I didn't get the yellow character to wave in this drawing, I'm going to make this one wave. Once I let that dry, I use my sharpie and I go around the character. And I even draw in where his goggles will be. It's kind of wet with the paint, but I try and do it anyway. It's not going to be perfect just yet. Then I get some paint and I start coloring in the character all over. For this one, I'm going to be using some orange. So that way it stands out a little bit more than the others. Once I finish, I add in the title Among Us. And I even make the A have the little character in it. Also, don't forget to sign your name when you finish your drawing or your painting. Now we're pretty much done with this drawing. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you want to see more art tutorials or more how to draws, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe down below. And don't forget to hit the notification bell for more. If you want to help support me on other social medias, feel free to follow me on Instagram at artwithartemis. And you can follow me on Twitter at artemisarrow64. Anyways, thank you all once again. Until next time, see ya!